How is it going? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome, welcome back to WM Entertainment. My name is Priest, and today I'm bringing you guys a Overwatch basic guide for the cyborg ninja we all know and love, Mr. Genji. Now, Genji is a cyborg ninja, the pro ninja, the king of the parkour. Now, let's get into this vid. Now, I'm very excited to be bringing you guys the basic guide for Genji. Genji is a hero that I've covered once in a Grandmaster Guide on the channel. Now, Genji has two basic attacks. The R2, which is his long-distance ninja throw stars, and his L2, which is up close and personal. Um, like, for example, someone pops up right here. Boom, 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 dead. Um, that's His L2 is for up close personal range. Now, Genji is the cyborg ninja brother of Hanzo, which is the cyborg archer, and he is the boyfriend of the, he is a very lucky man, because he is the boyfriend of the healer everybody knows, Mercy. Now, we're in this basic guide, we'll be trying to quickly cover, um, we'll cover all of his moves, his abilities, um, and briefly covering his all. So, yes, Genji, wow, that was quick. Genji is the cyborg ninja. Now, he does have the two basic attacks. Like I said, his R2 is for the longer distance, and his L2 is for up close. Now, his sweep attack is the L1 attack. It can be used good for any 1v1 duel against another Genji, and for getting over locations. That little quick L2, L1 swipe is... Fantastic. Now, Genji, if I was aware of that Widowmaker, Genji is big against Widowmakers. It makes, um, he is very hard to snipe. Now, this is your basic guide, so this Widowmaker is really picking me apart. It's because I'm not jumping around in the air more. Now, Genji should always be just like I'm doing right now, double jumping, jumping in the air, keeping in the air, not laying foot on the ground, and even reflect Widowmaker's bullets back at her with his R1. So that brings us to his next move, the R1. Now his R1 is his reflecting. He can reflect um, bullets back at people. He can even reflect McCree's um, high noon. He can reflect um, many ultimates. He can reflect Reaper's death blossom back at its Reaper self, um, making him fantastic of a hero to use. Um, doing tons of damage, and you can even be up for voting for reflecting damage. Now, I've freaking got um, a lot of issues right now with this enemy team. This is actually a pro team, so having a little bit of a uh, hard time trying to take them out. But Genji is just the cyborg ninja everybody loves. He's an amazing hero. Um, he's a load of fun once you get better with him, obviously. I mean... This is just a basic guide. I have done the Grandmaster Guide for Genji. So if you guys wanted to see that, um, make sure you check it out. Along with subscribing to Dub Game Entertainment. Your support is always greatly appreciated. Um, and let's continue talking about the Cyborg Ninja Genji. Right now we're trying to talk about his art as much as we can hit of it. Um, with this enemy team is very hard and very stressful. I'm so stressed out right now. Um, because, I mean, we're, we're getting destroyed right now. But Genji, his Ultimate is one of, is the hardest to use of all Overwatch heroes, DPS-wise. Genji's awe is worse than Hanzo's. It's harder to use than Hanzo's. Hanzo's is pretty complicated. But... Genji's makes Hanzo's look easy. Now I mean easy. Because, I mean, Genji's is he's a cyborg. Genji is a very hard to use art. And if it's not used right, then it won't be very successful. And you saw in the gameplay when I'm up close like that, I used my L2 instead of R1. Or R2. It actually was pretty successful.
like I said, you're gonna have a lot of um, practice using Genji's Aw, and Genji's Aw is actually pretty more, it's much more complicated than um, most heroes, and it's hard for Genji's Aw to take out tanks. Now here's a little tip for um, people that are in 1v1 duels with all the Genjis. When you first see a Genji, the first thing they're gonna do when they lay eye contact on you is hit their R1 and try to reflect. But if you don't do anything and you just dash at them, hitting your first hit, take a swing, then they all start attacking you, you reflect their back at each other, then you just do your quick attacks and take out the Genji. It's pretty easy to 1v1 another Genji. Um, it's hard to 1v1 a Widowmaker, however, it shouldn't be too, too hard um, if you are a good Genji. A good Genji should be able to take them out, a Widowmaker out pretty quickly, um, using the kit to the best of his ability. Now, something I did want to cover um, before we actually lose this match um, is that Genji can't reflect beam attacks. He can't reflect May's basic freeze. He can't reflect Moira's orbs or... Moira's, or he can reflect Moira's auras, but he cannot reflect her normal beam. So that's pretty much it. Thank you all for watching. Okay. If you guys did go to enjoy, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more Overwatch and guys. Subscribe to the channel. Check out my other ones, and see ya. Peace out.